Well, hello, my friend, and welcome to my channel. Today, I've got a little bit of a different video to share, and I don't want you guys to be shocked, but these are my long nails now, believe it or not. My patch on this nail, um, I just did it just a couple of days ago, and the crack was just too far over, and I just didn't feel like messing with it again, so I figured this would be a great opportunity to just take the patches off, shorten them all back, do a fresh start, and today I'll be using that tool that I got from Beauty Big Bang to review here on my channel, so perfect timing, I'm assuming. But this is the little tool. I will have the information listed below for this one. It's just a really nice, um, heavy-duty, solid tool. So we are going to give that a try. I've been soaking these nails in pure acetone for a little while, and uh, there we go. I had a patch that was using the Jealous, Jealous foundation, and I'm just going to use this, and I am going to have to soak this more than once, because this was a rather thick patch, and um, I want to get all of it off, but I just wanted to show you guys how great, this is really nice, I am liking this. Of course, you guys know I'm right-handed, so I'm using my left hand to maneuver this tool around. I'm going to just scrape off what I can. I didn't do any filing to the top of it, which, you know, normally I do, um, to get, you know, get down through that top coat, but I didn't do that this time, because, you know, being a patient, inpatient ninny, so that's okay. But if you want it to go faster, you definitely want to file down what you can, and then do your soak off, and then do this step. So you will get to see me struggle and bump along down the road on the struggle bus with this. But this is not the product's defect. This is um, the user's defect. But this tool is really nice because I'm not gouging. It's not sharp. I'm not gouging anything. It's it. I feel really safe doing it this way, and when I saw this tool on their site, I was really excited to try it, and um, so there we go. We're going to stop right there, rub off the excess. I am going to, well, look at that, more of it's even coming off. Wow. Well, this was the fresh patch, and um, you know, so that's that's kind of kind of cool. <laughs> All of it is coming off, but I am going to soak it because I want everything totally off. I want to be able to use my nail teaks and for it to be able to penetrate, you know, down into the nail. So I'm going to go soak this one some more, and then we're going to come back and kind of talk about this. Be right back. Okay, I am back for my final round of the removal, I hope, I would imagine, of this uh, here patch that I had on my nail using this groovy little tool. Um, I do believe that most of this came up with the last round and you can tell I'm using pure acetone because I am gnarly up around my cuticles. Okay, that's part of my nail that was partly broke so I'm going to have to do some filing on that. Let's go over here to this one. This nail's been broke for a while and I was able to salvage it past the owie point, um, give it time to grow out, and I'm pretty happy about that. That's normally my main focus when I have a break or whatever. I don't, I don't care to keep patches on my nails, so, you know, this is just, uh, just, for me, they're temporary just to get them to grow out past that, that point where they hurt. I don't want no hurting like most of, most of the rest of you. I don't want it to hurt. So I really do like this tool. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just go ahead and give you my thoughts on it now because this is not an exciting video. No cool nail art or anything. But, you know, you might also be like me and, and have a need for something like this. I wanted to let you know that it is out there. Um, the last time I did a removal video, I scared some people with my technique, so um, hopefully, hopefully this kind of redeems that. I am not a gel polish or gel foundation 
normal user, so um, I'm still learning. If you have any tips for anything like that, then let me know, because I am really excited to learn stuff from others. So I'm going to get some more acetone, I'm just going to try to wipe around. Let's see, because it's kind of crunchy looking. I do think I've got most of it. I think mostly what I'm seeing now is acetone, dryness, and funkiness. But, <laughs> look at my fingers dented. Um, but there you go. It's all off, and it came off easily. I've got a little pile of crummies down here. And I'm pretty stoked about this little tool. So I'm going to go file my nails and get ready to do a manicure. I hope you found this um, informative and if you would like to check on this tool I will leave a link for Beauty Big Bang down below and also a link to this direct a direct link to this product. So thanks for hanging in there with me. I appreciate you watching. That is it for today. Until next time, be good to yourself. Talk to you soon. Bye.